Hi, this is Yolanda Van Veen, and in this segment, we're going to talk about how to grow wheatgrass outside. Now, wheatgrass is all the trend, and many people are growing it in little containers indoors, especially for their cats and dogs to nibble on because it's so full of all types of nutrients. Now, you can turn around and plant it right outside. Just like any other grass, like the grass on your lawn, it's just a set of roots. And so you can break it into pieces or you can just grow it as it is. Just set it right in the soil and it'll grow like a nice ornamental grass. And you can trim it out as needed. Also, when you're growing it outside, there's many easy ways to grow, even if you only have a patio. So you can use all types of recycled materials, too. By just putting um, some material on the bottom and filling it with soil, or using a container too, even a small container, you can grow it yourself right in soil. And when you're growing outside, it's easier to grow in soil, I found, than hydroponically, or if you're trying to grow it um, just in a little bit of soil itself. I like to grow it right into the dirt or right into your garden. But in the containers, the trick is, is to make sure you always have fresh seed and seed that hasn't been baked. So a lot of times if you buy wheat grass seed or wheat seed in the store, it's been baked and it won't generate any seed, it won't grow. So when you sprinkle it on, I just try to use more than I think I need. And always make sure to and cover it about one inch with soil, or up to two inches even, barely covering it. And then just add water. And the trick is when you're growing seeds outside, you don't want to use a heavy stream of water. You want just a little bit of a mist to make it really moist. And you never want to let it dry out too much, and you never want it sitting right in water. As long as the wheatgrass is in a sunny spot, it will grow. And you can start it as late as midsummer to early fall, as long as you have a warm season. It will come up and grow and be ready to harvest within a few weeks. It's that easy.